Welcome to Home Cooking with Song Chit. Today, I'm going to cook a very simple spicy stir fry yimi. This portion is for one serving. So, I have one portion of the yimi or dry eggs noodles, one stock of spring onion. I have two stock of kailan. This one I'm using only just um, the stem. Two tablespoons of garlic oil. If you do not have garlic oil, you can use just normal cooking oil. One tablespoon of oyster sauce. One tablespoon of crispy fried garlic. If you do not have the fried garlic, you can fry it right before cooking. I have one tablespoon of light soya sauce. One red chili cut into um, stripe. And I have five pieces of bird eye chili. This recipe is slightly on to a spicy side. If you like to have it less spicy, you can adjust the chili accordingly. And I have about 50 grams of chicken slices and one chicken egg. Since we have already prepared all the ingredients, I like to soak the noodle with hot water first. Dry yimi or egg noodles, right? It's very crispy, so before we can fry it, we need to soak it with hot water first for about one minute. So I'm just going to cover it with a plate. While waiting for the noodle to soak, I'm going to marinate the chicken with half of the light soya sauce. Alright, chicken is marinated. Now we're going to mix the sauce. We're going to put light soya sauce in the bowl and oyster sauce. So I put half of the garlic oil in the bowl and I'm going to add in about 2 tablespoons of water and we're going to mix it. Alright, the sauce is ready. Now we can go and take out the noodles. You see? Yimi is soaked in the hot water for one minute and I'm going to drain out the water. Heat the pan and I'm going to take just a little bit of garlic oil in the pan. Now we're going to cook the egg. I'm just going to cook the egg like that. Alright, egg is about 90% cooked. I'm going to switch off the heat and remove it from the pan first. Just put it aside. In the same pan, I'm going to switch on the heat and put in a little bit more of about 2 teaspoons of garlic oil. And now we're going to stir fry the chicken. You know the vegetable kailan stem, right? It takes a long time to cook, so I'm going to put it in. If you have a leaf vegetable like bok choy or choy sam, you can put it in later. But for this vegetable, right, it's taking longer time to cook, so I'm put it together with the chicken. Just gonna add in a little bit of garlic. Put in all the bird eye chili. Give it a stir for about 2 minutes until the chicken and the kailan is cooked. Alright, chicken and the vegetable is cooked and the chili has released a very nice fragrance. Now I'm going to put in the noodles. Add on the garlic oil, the egg, chili spring onions and the sauce that we mix give it a stir now we're going to put in the fried garlic
looks so yummy. All right, all the ingredients are well combined. Everything is cooked, and now I am going to taste it. Hmm, delicious. Enough taste, enough flavor. Spicy, lovely. At this stage, if you want to add any more seasoning, you can do so. Like sugar, or you want to add in a little bit of sour lime, is okay. So, but for this one, the taste is alright. I'm going to now switch off the heat. This is best served when it's hot, so I'm going to dish out and serve. For this noodle, we don't need to cut the chili because it has enough chili and it's very delicious and spicy. Let's eat! I'll take a bit of chili. Mm. Wow, it's delicious. Enough taste, enough flavor. The noodle is so soft and it's well combined with all the ingredients. And most importantly, it's spicy. Delicious. You have got to try. I give it a thumbs up. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, please share with your friends and remember to subscribe for more of my simple cooking like this. Thank you and bye-bye.